What is up, Living Every Minute homies? Ryan here, and today I wanted to talk to you about asymmetric bets. What are they, and how can we use them to improve our everyday lives? So first off, what is an asymmetric bet? It is simply a bet that is skewed in one favor or the other, and obviously we want the odds to be stacked in our favor as often as possible. And the way we do this is we know and we limit the downside up front and we maximize the upside. So one of the best examples I have of this is Richard Branson, the founder of Virgin. Whenever he founded Virgin Airlines, he made a deal with Boeing where he could lease the plane for one year and give it back if the airline did not succeed. So he had his downside capped at about $2 million and the upside was Virgin succeeding and turning out to be the multi-billion dollar company that it is today. So how do we do this in our everyday lives? So obviously we are fielding a lot of uncertainty whenever we make decisions. Uh, there's a lot of variables that we don't know how we're going to uh, play out and we still have to make decisions in lieu of that uncertainty. Whenever we get to the end of our life, essentially the quality of the life that we lived is going to be based on the decisions we made. So we want to be making as good of decisions as we can and try to make asymmetric bets with those decisions. Um, so how can we do this? Uh, a good way to start is with our journal and with some of the main um, areas that we focus on. With health, it's easy to make asymmetric bets because you can eat right and exercise and the upside is going to be much greater than the downside of the couple of hours that are going to uh, go into that. Uh, when it comes to relationships, obviously we deal with a lot of uncertainty when dating. Um, you could have your heart broken, um, it cannot work out, but the downside is still pretty limited uh, compared to the upside of possibly finding the person that you're going to spend the rest of your life with and share a lot of happiness with. Um, sharpening the sword, um, anytime you're pouring into yourself, there's obviously going to be exponential upside compared to the time that it takes to read a book or go to a seminar or go through um, Valkyrie or Gladiator. Um, so with all this said, I just want to encourage you to think about how you can limit the downside in any decision you make and how you can maximize the upside. Because essentially, if you make a lot of asymmetric bets in your life, a few of them are going to work out and those home runs are going to uh, counteract some of the strikeouts that you've had whether it be starting a lot of businesses or failed relationships, those losses are gonna stack up and eventually all that experience is gonna allow you to make better decisions in the future. And like I said, eventually hit some of those home runs. So I hope all this has been helpful. Um, if you enjoyed this insight, a lot of this is derived from one of my favorite books, Thinking in Bets by Annie Duke. Uh, she's a professional poker player and she kind of talks about just how to make asymmetric bets. Um, with all this said, I hope you guys have a great day and keep on living every minute. Peace.